In the annals of medical history, few stories are as profound and ethically compelling as that of Dr. Jonas Salk, the American virologist who developed the first successful polio vaccine. In 1955, his inactivated polio virus vaccine, IPV, was declared safe and effective, marking a watershed moment in the global fight against a disease that terrified generations. But what truly immortalized Dr. Salk was not just his scientific breakthrough, but his radical decision regarding its ownership. When the vaccine proved its power to curb the polio epidemic, Salk was faced with a monumental choice. In an era where patenting a medical discovery was standard practice, he was urged to secure a patent for his vaccine. Such a move would have granted him exclusive rights to its production and sale, guaranteeing immense personal wealth for decades to come. Yet, Sock refused. He consciously and deliberately chose not to patent his invention. His reasoning was as simple as it was revolutionary. He believed that a vaccine of such critical importance to global public health should be a people's vaccine, accessible to all without the barriers of cost or proprietary control. He famously viewed the vaccine not as an invention to be owned, but as a discovery to be shared, much like a natural law of the universe. The financial consequence of this ethical stance was staggering. It is estimated that by foregoing the patent, Dr. Salk effectively relinquished a fortune estimated at over $7 billion in today's currency. He extended this philosophy to all monetary rewards. While he accepted honorary accolades, he declined any substantial cash prizes for his work. For him, the reward was in the healing of humanity, not in personal enrichment. His conviction was perfectly encapsulated in a now legendary exchange. During a 1955 television interview, the host, Edward R. Murrow, posed the question, who owns the patent on this vaccine? Sock's reply was immediate and iconic. Well, the people, I would say. There is no patent. Could you patent the sun? This rhetorical question cut to the heart of his belief system. He saw the vaccine as a fundamental human right, as essential and as naturally belonging to everyone as sunlight. To claim ownership of it felt, to him, both morally wrong and logically absurd. Dr. Jonas Salk's legacy, therefore, is twofold. He is remembered as the brilliant scientist who defeated a crippling disease, freeing countless children from its threat. But perhaps more enduringly, he is celebrated as a paragon of selfless science, a man who placed the well-being of humanity above profit and demonstrated that the greatest discoveries are those we give away. In an age often dominated by intellectual property battles, his question, could you patent the sun, remains a powerful and timeless challenge to our priorities.